Hello, and welcome to Let's Play a Resident Evil Umbrella Chronicles Part 2. Billy and Rebecca discovered a ropeway under the church, a huge bat habitat, and rode it down to a factory. It was deep within that the two found the true source of the monsters. I'll bet we'll find the source of the problem down there. Let's go. Okay. Was missing a the in that sentence? It didn't make sense. Right. Now can I get a headshot? Come on! Thank you. Oh, I found a thing. I remember this place well. Hello, Zombie. I can't appear to get a headshot. Come on. Well, I accidentally blew them up with a grenade. Oh, never mind. Up there, watch out! Oh, great. Monkeys. Just what I didn't want to see. Oh, well. Oh, go away! Right, that's it. I'm gonna shoot you in the head. Come on. There we are. Any more? Nope. Zombies. What on earth is he doing? He's got. Ah! No! These guys all seem to have impenetrable heads. One of them's got a hat. Can't get a headshot with this. Go away! I need to try and get better at these headshots. I will learn. I'm not going to pretend to be an expert at these kind of games, but as long as I can efficiently get through the level, then I suppose it's okay. Do you mind? Ugh. So here we are, this sort of Resident Evil 2-like area. Oh, right, grenade. You're still alive! Kindly die. Oh, got a machine gun. I'm nearly dead now. We can get down using this. No, we can't. I just shot it. Uh-oh. Now, can I get a critical hit? If anything needs improving in the ranking screen, it's critical hit, so let's try. Come on. Oh, headshot. Headshot. Brilliant. Finally. Can I get a headshot, please? Come on. Headshot. That's three headshots in a row. Headshot. Come on. A few more headshots. Now. Damn. How dare you try and scratch me! Oh well, never mind. Got a few headshots, and we've got to deal with a leech man. Perfect! I hate leech men. Go away! Dead. But fear not, because I have been resurrected. Like Jesus, with a gun. It's raining leeches. Yeah. All these guns and no umbrella. It's getting pretty hectic. I don't like this. Haha, <laughs> leave me alone. Okay, so I've got less than half life now. I've used up my first aid spray. I've got no more grenades. Now what am I gonna do? Haha. <laughs> I cannot wait to see my rank for this level. It's gonna be rubbish. Now, can I get a um, headshot at all? Anything? I'm surrounded. Leave me alone. No munching on Rebecca's head. Hmm. No exploded heads there. Too bad. Uh oh. I remember this place. Are we going to find a boss? Yeah. What is that thing? 
He is a tall, muscular, naked man. Placed in the game to appeal to the ladies. So far, he hasn't attacked me once, but here we are, shooting him, murdering him deliberately to death. That's right, you turn around. Nobody here wants to see your bottom. Especially me! And it is for this reason... You have to die. Sorry. Uh-oh. So, that was the tyrant. An inveterate nudist. And this man is bald. But I put him out of his misery. Because I'm nice. Four critical hits. Felt like loads. Ugh. All right, fine. Only four. Huh? Oh, what now? You! You're lucky that I don't have a grenade, or I will blow you all up. Shotgun time. You can get some really good enemy kills from these things if you have a grenade. Oh, grenade there. Hang on. Right. Ah. No. Ah. Oh. You stupid camera! You are facing the wrong way. If it was up to me, I would be risking life and limb to get those grenades. Look at all these things. Oh, brilliant! Right, get rid of this guy first. He's too close for comfort. Stop attacking me! Just because I'm shooting you numerous times, that gives you no justifiable reason for attacking me. But I got the grenade, so I'm gonna throw it at this guy. Look at all those leeches. Dead. I've got a herb. Just what I needed. Uh-oh. Hello, Mr. Lynchman. Ah. Already I'm on caution. Thanks a lot. Hmm. Now where am I? Uh-oh. Run! Ah! <laughs> Made it! Whoa. Look at all these leeches. There must be something we haven't seen yet. Uh-oh. That's the guy from the picture. Marcus? But you're dead. Ten years ago. Spencer had me assassinated, and stole all of my research. However, something wondrous happened. The T-Virus fused with the leeches, and brought me back from the darkness of death. I will have my revenge on Umbrella, and the world will burn in an inferno of hate! Hey, you're looking great! Okay, we've got a herb, and a shotgun. We're going to need it. James Marcus, revived through the power of leeches, infused with the T-Virus. And now, he's turned into Mega Leech Man. Strutting down the walkway, sporting the latest line in leech attire, and I'm sure you'll agree it looks marvelous. Damn, it's not working! Oh, don't be so pessimistic, of course it's working. Soon, it's going to be the latest thing. Everyone's going to want a pair of leech trousers. Although, I'm not entirely sure I like the whole throwing leeches at my head thing. I wish I'd stop that. And whipping me in the face is going to deduct marks. Shame on you, James. Shame on you. I need to do it again. Okay. Where's he gone? There you are. Stay away from me. Unlike the tyrant, there's no obvious weak point. I don't know what I'm supposed to be shooting. Am I shooting the tentacles or the head or... 
He's just a weird mass of... Bleh. But he's dead, so that's good. Oh, no. Herb. Good. Uh-oh. I will. Oops. Self-destruct? Yes, self-destruct. That's what they do at the end of Resident Evil games. It is a staple and a tradition to be upheld even in these abridged reimaginings. Great. Come on, move. All right, here we go. What the hell is that thing? Billy, be careful. It's catching up. Have a guess what it is. We've just been fighting it, and it's turned even bigger. I got it. Aim for the mouth. Why are you so big? This monster doesn't know when to give up! Luckily, I've got lots of shotgun shells. Sort of. I just hope it's enough. Some of these Resident Evil monsters, they fall straight into lava, then they just come out again. Oh dear, my coat's burnt off. Let's just hope that I don't run out of bullets. Ha! Given up! Oh, no he hasn't. Okay. When you say still, that's the time to reload. But I've only got nine bullets left. Come on! What does that prove? I don't like sunlight. I have absolutely no shotgun shells, but I do have a grenade launcher, so that's good. Hmm. Okay. It appears that it doesn't die unless it's in the sunlight. We're going to have to drive it back into the sun. Uh, excuse me? What do you think you're doing? Get back into the sunlight. And I want this shotgun. Aim for its weak spot. That seems to drive it back. Thank you, Billy. You're so smart. Okay. Let's drive it into the sunlight. Grenade launcher time. Won't you ever give up? Come on. We're half-life down. Though, I'm not too happy about using all of my machine gun bullets. I might need them. Come on, get back into the sun. Please? Thank you, sir. Uh-oh. No, 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 I don't have any grenade guns left. At this rate, I'm going to end up having to use my handgun. Oops. We better keep our distance. Nine, eight, seven, Right, I'm really running out now. Come on, get back. I don't think I'm going to survive this. But don't give up hope, we're so close! That's good. Okay, here we go. I guess it's time to say goodbye. People are waiting for me. Officially, Lieutenant Billy Cohen is dead. Rebecca, thank you. overcame impossible odds and made it out alive. Lucky, I suppose. Since the event, Billy Cohen has gone missing. While Rebecca is about to enter a new nightmare 
as she heads for the mansion. Okay, here we go. Clear time, S. Enemies killed, S. Critical hits, B. Objects destroyed, B. Files obtained, 1. Nyeh. Nah, that's a bit rubbish. But we got a grenade launcher. Mission Incident is now available. So that's the events of Resident Evil 1. Wesker scenario beginnings. That's what we're going to be doing next. But first... Okay, I have replayed the level. And this time? S S A A A. Ah, that's much better. Fantastic. See, I'm only really showing the blind run, but I still want to get a decent rank at the end of it. So, S or A, I can deal with that. So overall, we got an S rank for the Resident Evil Zero scenario. Great. Okay. Now let's see what Wesker was up to during all of this. The plans to reuse the management training facility were scrapped by Marcus's unfortunate outburst. Not only that, but the incident appeared to spread the virus to the area surrounding the mansion, causing a biohazard outbreak. It is time to abandon the sinking ship that is Umbrella. <laughs> Sorry, that looks wrong. The virus is out. We can't hide this anymore. It appears Umbrella is finished. We're just gonna walk away? Our research isn't complete. We can make a more powerful virus. Do what you like. The T virus is near completion and only needs test data. That is why Stars is in place. I will bring them into the mansion. Damn it! I better get rid of this place before there are any more complications. Hmm. Okay, we're playing as Wesker. How fun! Wesker here. I will use the ropeway to return to the training facility and depart from there. We have just witnessed Wesker and William Birkin being evil. Because that's what they do best. Headshot. Brilliant. And I appear to have picked up a magnum. I'm just trying to see how many things I can destroy. It all counts towards the end game rank. The power is out. I need to get it running. The power room should be down below. Yes. Okay. First I need to get past this zombie. Get away from me, you! Headshot! Fantastic. Once again, I'm trying to get as many headshots or critical hits as I possibly can. What was it they said in Zombieland? Just exhale slowly and squeeze the trigger. No need to double tap when you're missing a head. What are you going to do? Bleed on me? Ha! Yes, you run away, you cowards! They're scared of me. Oh, maybe not. Running away from the big spideys. I don't know why. I like spiders. Spiders are good. I saw a really massive spider in my house the other day. Not quite as big as these ones, but still pretty large. And I went to go and find something to pick it up to take it outside. I looked away for a second, and when I looked back, it was gone. <gasps> really, these giant spiders are at a disadvantage. They can't hide anywhere, can they? They're just sort of, um... Too big to do that. Sorry, I'm trying to focus on all of these hectic things going on around me. Oh dear, what's going to happen this time? You! Where do you come from? Stupid little monkey, go away! Sorry, I had to do that. They're dropping down from the ceiling. That's a big drop! They must be made of strong stuff. 
Oh dear. No, don't you... Go away! I'm going to die any second now. There's tons behind me as well. But I didn't kill. Grenade! Hmm. This is never ending. I'm pretty rubbish shooting the monkeys as it is. And now there's thousands of them, and I'm not exaggerating. Okay, good. Ah, zombies again. Good old zombies. Can't go wrong with them. Headshot! Come on. Headshot! Nope, didn't get a headshot then. I don't need that yet. I'll pick it up if I need it. You caught up quick! Where'd you come from? Okay. This isn't good. No, 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 no. That's the problem. If you're trying to get headshots and you fail, then they're just all getting closer and closer and closer to you. Which isn't good. Let's reload. Get ready. Okay, we've got more herbs. It's also a problem. You might not pick up a herb because you might not need it at that particular moment, but you might not turn around to face it to pick it up later on. You've just got to sort of hope for the best. And we've got raining leeches once again. Go away! I'm gonna step on you. Squish, 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 squish. That was a hobby of mine back in Resident Evil Zero. Squishing leeches. Ooh, got all these computers to blow up. Huh. We found a thing. Oh dear, yeah, this is where we operate the power. Luckily, even though we threw a grenade at it, it still works. How are we doing? Six critical hits? Okay, not bad, I suppose. For me. I hear leechmen! Here's a brilliant question. In this first-person game, why is Wesker's vision just the same as everybody else's, even though he's wearing sunglasses? I suppose it's for the best. You wouldn't be able to see a thing otherwise. Wesker's just showing off. He thinks he's so great. Look what I could do in my sunglasses. Wesker wears black all the time. He's got a stupid, posh voice. Clearly, he's just trying to be me. He even wants to be... A let's player. That's why I let him do the narrations during the cutscenes. Normally I'd do it, but um, why not? Let him have a go. I'm surprised, really. Here we are in one of Wesker's evil lairs, in the world of Resident Evil, and yet he's here fighting all of these monsters. Does he not have a secret passage hidden behind a bookcase monster-free? Apparently not. Oh well. So far, so good. We just need to make our way back to that rail car. If we can. Of course I can! I'm Wesker. I'm so evil. Still can't seem to get headshots, though. Come on. More of them. Okay, this is where it gets really difficult. When it's hectic, the camera's moving all around, and there's about 500 billion zombies. Headshot! Finally! Okay, good. Another headshot. Uh-oh. Get away from me! Don't make me laugh unconvincingly in your direction. Come on. Headshot! Too close! For God's sake! Who would have thought so many people existed? So overpopulated. I think if we're to learn anything from this, it's that you should never have children. They'll get bad eating habits and they'll grow up to become morons. Morons with heads that refuse to blow up. What earth am I shooting at? OK, 
Okay, are you all dead? Good. Now, if you excuse me, I need to get down to that rail car. Yeah, he's back. So we have to just try and run around him, I suppose. He didn't have a life bar yet, so until then, we keep away from him and press Z. Haha, -ha, you can't get me. I'm kind of getting used to the Wii controls now. Be. You know, if I see Z and I accidentally say X, that's years and years and years of using a PlayStation controller. Nearly 20. Games sure have come a long way since Die Hard Trilogy. I remember that I have, in fact, played a rail shooter before, and that's what it was, Die Hard Trilogy. Though I remember as a kid, I was more amused by the fact that I could interact with things. I was shooting all of the hostages for fun, but now I'm older, wiser, and we're going to take this more seriously. Besides, there are no hostages to shoot, so um, they're quite safe. I find that's the best thing. Take away the temptation. If you cannot, if you cannot walk past a sweet shop without buying sweets, don't have money in your pocket, then you won't buy them because you can't unless you steal. Sorry, sir. Well, at least he wasn't a hostage. Oh, for- Apparently even this refuse has T's recovery ability. Oh, yes. We're gonna to have to shoot him in the head, then. At last, we've got a life bar. Did I say head? I meant heart. That was quick. Brittle. The B.O.W. still needs a little more work. Well, he's asleep now. So what can I destroy before we get to the train? A bit of last-minute destruction. All these lights. Look at them all. May as well use up my machine gun bullets. Alright. The results. Clear time S. Enemies killed S, critical hits, S, objects destroyed, S, and files obtained, S. That's more like it. Still, I think when it comes to this game, it's more about luck than actual talent. So, I won't be too smug just yet. Although, I am pretty amazing. It's great being me.